Most individuals and experts did not think we would even be here. This is the first successful eye transplant ever. It's the first time that an eyeball has been taken out of one person's body and transplanted into another's, and it's continued to survive for as long as it has. I'm Aaron James. I'm from Hot Springs Village, Arkansas. In 2021, I was in a work accident where I'd come into contact with uh, 7,000 volts to my face. And 2023, I received a face transplant and a whole eye transplant at NYU Langone. All the functional deficits that he initially presented prior to the operation, inability to eat, dependent on a feeding tube, tracheostomy for breathing, all that has been resolved. The quality of his aesthetic result is phenomenal. Arian's recovery has been remarkably accelerated. If we just measure, what we looked at is the hospital stay following his transplant. It was the shortest of all our patients. It's a good predictor of how he will function, how he will convalesce following the procedure. Aaron's eye is viable, and what that means is, first and foremost, it has not been rejected. We talk about when patients have transplantations done, that they can uh, reject the organ or the tissue that's being transplanted. We're a little bit over a year after the initial transplant, and the eyeball is beautifully round. The retina is perfectly vascularized. The fact is that Aaron needed a face transplant and respected. I mean, I didn't have an eye there anyway. I'm not losing anything. If we can get something going, that would help millions of people eventually. Although Aaron can't see out of this eye, this research is really important to one day bring sight to patients who were previously told they'd never be able to see. It feels good, you know, to say, hey, I, you know, I'm, I was a part of that. Kind of makes you stand up a little taller. You know, my quality of life is just, it's done a complete 180. You know, after my accident, I couldn't taste food or anything because I didn't have a nose. And that may not seem like a big deal, but when you go for a couple years, and then when you finally smell everything and taste everything, it's just, that's probably what sticks out most of all for me.